What's up everyone? Welcome back for the next game here in NHL 11. Alright, so this time we got, and please excuse me ahead of time for Americanizing the hell out of this pronunciation. Uh, yeah, because I'm definitely going to Americanize the fuck out of the pronunciation of this particular team. Alright, so this time we have the Olympics versus the Tiger... Tigress? Yeah, shit, that's Tigress. I thought it was Tigers at first, but it's actually Tigress. Wow. Never actually realized that. So, yeah, we have the Olympics versus the Tigress. Okay. That's interesting. Probably supposed to be in some kind of different language or something, but... Like I said, I'm going to Americanize the fuck out of it. So, it's the Olympics versus the Tigress. Okay. That's what I'm going with until I hear the announcers actually announce it correctly, so... Alright, anyway... <laughs> Let's get this party started. So we'll see what happens here. Can't chase these guys all over the ice. They'll just wear you out. Up the wing side, got it on the stick. There's a long dump in right there. Good job to get it into the offensive zone. Jim again. Wow. All right. So the Tigers off to a good start. That did not take long. An early goal by the home team. Fans love it. Players on the ice know this is their home rank. They got to feel good. Gary, if they can get another quick one, they've got a chance to run away on the scoreboard here. Quick shot. Great. Yeah, good try. Not quite able to make it happen, though. Three minutes gone in the first. The Tigers lead one nothing. Loose puck in the zone. He's yeah, got good a try. Nice Not quite able to make it in. Another good try there. And a good save as well. Offensive opportunity three on two. Nice play right there. Use the stick defensively. Under pressure back in that defensive zone. Got some good air time on that pass. Oh, wow. Fuck, that was a good try. What a save, Gary. I mean, you don't teach this in hockey school. Somehow he was able to make the save with his mask. In the slot, big chance. Good try, not quite able to make it. sound of iron that a goaltender loves. chance in the slot well that was a scoring opportunity with that one wide no his direction finder was off got it where he wanted it and got it on goal. yeah good, good try but not able to make it happen so they go for the face off well this game is about split second decisions and the goaltender i think made a smart one get the pressure off by freezing it and getting the face off Two 
Ooh. Good scores, the Olympiques, or however the hell you pronounce that. They tie it up. It is really nice to see a pot of gold at the end of the rainbow of hard work. Use your body, tie him up, and leave the fight for somebody else. He did. Off the right side. Two on two the other way. There's an offensive opportunity. Good save that time. He denied any room to move. All right. So going for a face off. Over six minutes left here in the first period. Good battle at both ends of the ice. And another face off. At one apiece. Pressure's on now. He's got to move that puck. Gagnon. Not sure what they're doing there, but okay. Finally get it out of there. From down low, back up to the blue. That's the goal scoring right there. Makes the save. Good try. He had to squeeze the pads. Ooh, yeah, really good try. Nobody's got control of that puck yet. Good scrum along the wall. No more puck on that stick. Nice move. Good quick pass right there. Kicked away with a blocker. Good scoring opportunity right there. Ooh. The yeah, behind the back save a little bit there. And yet again, another face-off. Seems like there's been a lot of fucking face-offs. And another fucking face-off. Jesus. Remember what I said about there being a lot of face-offs? I oh, said so that guy was only like 5'11". Even I'm like 5'9", five... I think? I don't know exactly how tall I am, to be honest. Mostly because I don't really give a shit. But... I think I'm like 5'9", or something, I want to say. So that guy's actually not too much taller than me. Although I guess in hockey it's not as important to be tall as it is in some other sports, like maybe football or... Uh, Basketball. Even in football, short guys can still have a lot of success. It just helps, you know, for like receivers and shit if they're a bit taller. Gives the quarterback a little bit more options, I suppose. But being small, I guess, has its advantages for running backs, so. Kind of depends. Alright. Well, guys, we'll see what happens in the second period, so stay tuned, and I'll see you all then. Peace out.